Hello blokes and shalers and welcome to Enderman Education. I'm your host Spencer West and today on the show we shall be talking about the characteristics of Enderman, touch upon the origins of the species and most importantly discuss how to survive. Follow me mates! Endermen are dark creatures, averaging around 3 meters in height, with long appendages. They are known to be passive, preferring to peacefully place blocks in interesting shapes and patterns. Now, upon sight with an Adventura, they will freeze up, and upon Adventura averting their gaze, they will attack. If the Adventura was to run, the Enderman will teleport right behind them. Don't try hiding in your little shelter either. They'll just tear down the door. Now, some say that Endermen are distant relatives of the legendary Slenderman. What do you uh, have to say on the topic there, uh, Slenderman? <coughs> What a character, this guy. Oh, subscribe to EDJ. Uh, oh, hello. I didn't see you there. But I guess now it's time to delve into the history of the Enderman. You know, mate, it's widely believed that the remnants of explorers are gone, all victim to the treasures of the far lands. They are ghosts, walking in the footsteps of where they used to explore. Shadows of travellers long gone, the unformidable physics of the far lands twisting and malforming their bodies and their souls until there's nothing left. Why they freeze on sight is unknown, mate, but uh, I personally believe they're just shy about uh, being dead and all, maybe a little embarrassed. But now, we're into the most important part of the presentation. How to survive an encounter. Firstly, wearing a pumpkin on your head is the best way to deal with endermen, as they can't see you, your ugly face, and as such, won't make it their life's goal to rid the world of you. But if you don't have a pumpkin on your backpack, because you're not the pumpkin collecting type, here's what you should do. Your best bet is to deal with each Enderman by never losing eye contact with them. They'll be so petrified of your face that they'll freeze. Whereupon you run at them and chop them into pieces like the ninja you are. An ugly ninja. When dealing with more than one, try your hardest to round them up so you can see both and that they can both see you. Your horrible looks are surprisingly powerful with the ability to stop at least a thousand in the men in their tracks. They are also deathly allergic to water and are able to survive swimming through a pool of lava. So plan your buildings accordingly. Moats of water have a practical use now, mates. In conclusion, you're not very good looking. You're actually quite ugly. Oh, oh, and Endermen. They're pretty cool. And not ugly. Unlike you, because you're quite ugly. You're very ugly. This presentation was sponsored by SkinCraft. Get a new skin today, you ugly monster.